Alrighty, so now that I've explained that, I want to actually upload video and show you how to do some editing. So to do that on the Chromebooks, first you want to use the native video recorder app to do the recording. After you record it, make sure you save it to your Chromebook, and when it's on your Chromebook, upload that to your Google Drive. So let's say I've done all that already. I want to put it in WeVideo. I'm going to press this up arrow. Now I want to drag and drop files here. I'm actually just going to press Google Drive because I want to import it from my Google Drive. Uh, I save the videos to my WeVideo folder. And let's import these two. I'm going to select them both. I'm going to upload it to My Media. And I'm going to press Upload. Again, I don't want to share it with anyone. Let's just go to My Media. Upload. So it's going to work its magic. It might take a little time depending on how long your video is. Probably fast forward. Keep in mind while this is uploading, you can still close this out for now and look at your media. So I uploaded one already. Disregard these extra ones. These are, are videos that I did previously and media that I already uploaded. Um, if you press this again, it'll show you the status and both have been uploaded. All right. And you can see my, uh, you can clear them all, close out. Uh, you can see my goofy picture that I uploaded and uh, this other video. So all these are different videos that I uploaded doing the same thing. Pressing this up arrow, select it from my Google Drive, and did the upload. All right, so now I have some media. That's a very good. So now I want to drag it to my timeline because I actually want to make a video. So let's start with this video right here. Drag it right down here. And put it right next to that first video. Now you'll notice this one goes on for 10 seconds. That's a little too long for me. So I'm going to start from the beginning. I'm going to press play. And I'll say, I'd like it to end right about here, five seconds in. So I'm going to select this, ooh, five seconds in. I'm going to bring my mouse to the tip of this. You see that, how it kind of changes when you go there? Once it changes, I'm going to click and drag and move it over. You can see it right there at six seconds. I want to bring it down to about five seconds. Right about there. Boom, perfect. So now I shorten that to five seconds. All right, and then I want to bring this video over also, so it's connected. Now I want to see how this video starts. Let's see. Hello, my name is Mike Vidilla, and I'm the Assistant Director of Technology here at Upper Saddle University. Excellent. Good stuff. Let's say that's all I want for this video, so I want to cut it right there, exactly where it is. I'm going to press this scissor and watch. Boom! Snapped it. So now I cut this into two different pieces. I can move this over. I can delete it. If I realize I didn't want to delete it and that was a mistake, I can undo it by pressing uh, Command Z and it undoes anything. So that's a great thing about video editing. Don't be afraid to make a mistake because you can always undo and look back and get get whatever you deleted back up to, I believe, 10, 10 steps. So Command Z, I undid that. And let's say I want to connect them again, undo and undo and boom, there we have it. I'm all connected once again. So that's how you bring the video down here. Um, I'll go over trimming. Let's say I want to trim the end of this from here to there. I cut off a few seconds. And let's say I want to trim the middle of it right around here. Um, stop it right there. I'll cut it. And let's say I want to, I want to cut this. I want to cut this all the way. Ugh right here. I'm going to press that scissor again and I'm going to get rid of this piece by just highlighting it and pressing delete. Now it's gone and I can bring these two pieces together seamlessly and now it'll look like this. And you see that just happened right there. So that's the quick tutorial on how to bring upload video to this, bring it down to the timeline and just do some very basic trimming around there. Keep in mind that you could zoom in all the way down here. Wherever this blue line is, if I press this zoom in, it'll zoom in. I could drag this thing over. And that comes really in handy if you want to get specific. Because now you see it's easier to drag. Let's say I want to end this video right here at 17 seconds. It's just a lot easier to work with. So keep in mind, zoom in and zoom out right there. I covered that. I covered the basic trimming, cutting, and editing. And I'll cover some more in the next short video. Thank you very much.